our first like real big red carpet event, so it's super exciting. Yeah, it's new, it's it's fun, yeah. it's great experience so far, so looking forward to the show. Now, what's it like being in the spotlight and being a young mom? It has it. Do you think it's been harder or more helpful to have this outpouring of support? Because it seems like everyone has an opinion on Twitter. Um, there's good and bads, there's positives and negatives, but I think overall it's pretty good. Recently, um, you've talked a bit about your eagerness to maybe adopt in the future. How is that going? You know, with everything in my personal life, business life being so busy, I hope to do that, you know, in two years. I think I'll be in more of a stable place. But to be honest with you, I mean, like Sandra Bullock, like Charlie Stanton, all these people who are awesome and just so busy and adopting, I feel like I got a lot on my plate right now. Yes. I mean, I'm blessed to have a daughter who loves family, wants to embrace people. We have discussed it to know if that is right for us, and she's very open to that, which is super cool. So loving, my daughter is. So I, and that's really close to my heart about adoption. So I, I can't wait for that moment. And when I can embrace it, and I can really give my all to that, it'll be, it'll like impact and you know fill my life. Now with Teen Mom, you know, we just learned that Caitlin had entered into a treatment program. Is there anything you'd like to say to her while she's kind of going through this uh, very trying time? Yeah, I mean, I wish her the best of luck. I love Caitlin. We do a lot of projects together, and um, I think she's definitely making the best choice for herself and her family, so I hope everything goes smoothly. You brought up on your podcast that incident with the Uber driver. It, it, I mean, that must have been terrifying and went everywhere. Um, do you talk about safety with your daughter? I know she's so much younger, but... I mean, but school, our school area in our community, they are all about safety and precautions and those things. That's like number one to all of us and to every one of my family's safety. And I think everyone at home is like, we need to protect our children and our future generations. And I think we do that to the utmost now with our news and communicating awareness about incidents or accidents and those things and that's number one. Yeah. I mean stranger danger is always a first rule. Stranger danger sister. Uh, you made a comment that you had surpassed perhaps Kim Kardashian in the way with fame. Do you still stand by that statement or? I have surpassed anyone who ever, I mean I feel like I've surpassed anyone. Like I am my own person, they are their own person, I have my own goal and vision of success, you do and I don't feel like you should ever really be Comparing yourself to other people, it's really not realistic. It's a phony thing that people bring up. Well said, absolutely. Is there one thing you wish your fans knew about you that you don't think they already know? I mean, I'm a great mom. Let's just all agree. But yeah, thank you so much. Thank you. Have a good night. Have fun tonight.